Thanks for tuning in NFL fans. It's John Kuzma from endzoneblog.com. We're going to break down Dwayne Haskins' situation uh, with the Washington Redskins. So when Dwayne Haskins was coming out of the draft, uh, apparently Jay Gruden didn't want him. Um, we also heard reports that Daniel Snyder uh, did the drafting for the Washington Redskins on draft night. And it was kind of crazy that Jay Gruden went against his owner and decided to play Case Keenum. And we were hearing that, you know, Gruden doesn't like Haskins and all that. Because if uh, Daniel Schneider is paying you and he's signing your checks, he deserves a little bit of loyalty back. But for whatever reason, Jay Gruden didn't like Haskins. And that eventually led to Gruden's um, downfall with the Washington Redskins. He got, he got fired halfway through the year. And interim head coach Bill Callahan stepped in. Right away, he started Adrian Peterson. And then Bill Callahan decided to stick with Dwayne Haskins after Case Keenum suffered a concussion. So right away, Callahan decided to get his athletes on the field. And he figured, you know, if the Washington Redskins are a 1-8 team, they might as well get the rookies' development underway. And now Haskins finally has the support that he needs to, you know, uh, thrive with the Washington Redskins. You know, he's fallen behind Kyler Murray and Daniel Jones a little bit because Gruden didn't have his back. Those guys got on the field because they had the full support of the teams that drafted them, whereas, you know, Haskins wasn't as lucky. But, you know, now Haskins finally has that backing. Uh, from Bill Callahan and I think this is gonna be huge for his confidence you know his arm was never the problem you know I know he's struggling right now he's got no touchdowns and four interceptions but though that's a very small sample size that we've seen from Dwayne Haskins um, once he you know gets his confidence and obviously Callahan's gonna help in uh, that regard um, but once he gets his confidence, this team is going to be so much better. You know, everything that we saw at Ohio State when he was throwing for 50 touchdowns, uh, that's the player he can be when he's on and he's playing at, you know, a high level and up to his potential. So the Washington Redskins, and I believe Daniel Schneider, decided to go with Bill Callahan and hand the team over to, you know, uh, Callahan because, um of their long-term plan with Haskins. I think, you know, it was smart to get him on the field sooner rather than later. Um, Case Keenum was actually performing pretty well be before the concussion for the Redskins, but, you know, he's not the long-term answer for this football team. You know, Dwayne Haskins is. So you have to go with the guy who's going to be the centerpiece of your franchise for years to come. And, you know, it, it already took too long. He should have been on the field sooner. I think New York and Arizona are going to benefit from having Murray and Jones on the field. But now it's up to Haskins to show us something because he has had a slow start. And, you know, some of that has to be on his shoulders as well. You know, if you were truly a really good quarterback, you would have shown a little bit more. But, you know, most of uh, those four interceptions came in one game. He had one game where he had three interceptions. But, you know, we would have liked to see uh, a touchdown from Haskins a little bit sooner. But, you know, he has a chance to redeem himself. Uh, his, most of his football, obviously, is still way out in front of him. So, uh, you know, I think, you know, once D D uh, Dwayne Haskins kind of shakes uh, – once he kind of shakes off the rust – He's going to get back to, you know, being a player that, um, you know, can be relied on by his football team. I'm John Kuzma. Check out endzoneblog.com.